Hi, my name is Alex and I'm a 7th grader going into 8th grade. I'm 13 years old and I live in Cleveland, Ohio. Today we're going to be talking about my daily school routine in a, in a private grade school. I wake up usually at around 7.30 and get ready in 30 minutes to go to school at like 8 o'clock. My school starts at 8 o'clock. Luckily I live really close to the school so it takes only 5 minutes to get to school and so I have to only get myself ready and my little sister ready so it's really easy. When I get to school I usually there's like a morning morning schedule where you have like 30 minutes to like if you have any uh, unfinished homework that you can do if you have any teachers you have to see if you're if you're absent you have to go to your teachers um, then um, my first class starts and my classes are usually an hour and 30 minutes and I have a black block schedule that means that um, I don't have the same exact classes each day um, in the week I have different uh, classes each day so I only have four classes in one day I have two classes in the morning and then I have a break of 25 minutes to get ready for my next class in the afternoon and that break can consist of doing any homework so basically they're really like nice about like giving us time if we did, didn't do our homework so time to do homework for the afternoon classes then we have 25 to 30 minutes of recess and lunch which means like we can just like be outside and just talk with our friends and like play sports then we go to lunch which is like 25 minutes of just eating your lunch with your friends then we go back to homeroom and my school starts at 8 o'clock and then it ends at like 3 15. Usually, homework takes about like three hours. Like if you don't have your homework the next day, then you, if you don't bring it in the next day, then you don't get credit for it. Like they give credit if you do your homework. In math class, she just she just gives you like five points for each time that you have your homework done. Not at like, at least you like tried your homework. Like she will know if you like just wrote down random garbage onto your work. We have tests a lot in math and s math and social studies slash history um i have a really really small school but usually regular middle schools have like about 400 kids in like the entire grade and my school and that i have like 400 kids in my entire school right now i'm in the middle of summer from going from seventh grade to eighth grade and i have the same teachers from 6th grade, 7th grade, and 8th grade. Our school usually starts in August, around August 23rd, 24th, 25th, and ends around June 1st, May 31st, something like that, yeah. And I think the worst part of summer is that we have summer homework, but we don't get summer homework in all classes. We only have summer homework in reading and math. So for the math summer homework, we have like 13 pages of just like worksheets and for reading you just have to like pick a book to read and then you have to do like a book report on it thanks for watching and remember to subscribe and like if you like this video to our channel thank you